It's time to meet our sixth evicty. It's Jeremy! <laughs> oh, wow. um, how does it feel to be out? You keep it's, looking around going, I know, it's this bit, is wild, it's this weird, is crazy, like, you know what I mean? I'm wild. in a phone box two minutes ago and now yeah. I'm sitting here with you. It's just, uh, I think you lose track of the outside world, don't you? So it's a bit like kind of... Yeah. Coming out of a three-day party. Kind and my of thing, word, you it? really seem to have lost track of the outside a world. A little bit, yeah, I know. It's, uh, <laughs> a little I'll bit. I probably know it's now bit, looking so. back. Just... A little bit. Um, what did you think to your response tonight? Uh, it was mixed. Like it was, it was kind of what I expected. What I, what I kind of dived into in the house. I knew I was kind of sacrificing maybe a part of my time by. But I just followed my heart, do you know what I mean, and I just went with it. So. I, I, you got a more positive reaction. I think when you compare it to what Steph's getting, which is yeah, well, pretty negative. Yeah. You have gotten off pretty lightly. Yeah. Yeah, she doesn't deserve that, like, you know what I mean? I, know, I don't know um, what it looks like from the outside, but... Um, so why do you think you're sat here and not one of the other two? Um, I don't know. Like, I think people can always relate to what that girl's going through now. I think it's a part of life, what she had to do. And um, I just think maybe I got seen as a big bad wolf, maybe, and I, I contributed it. Obviously, it takes two to tango. I don't know. Um, I don't know why I'm sitting here, but I just enjoyed every minute that I was in there, do you know what I mean? So, yeah. You know, I've no regrets. We'll get more into Steph, as you did throughout your time <laughs> in the house. Uh, in a little while. It's bad, uh, that, like, <laughs> Emma, chill out. Like, you know what I mean? Give us a gag. If you're going to give us a relationship, yeah, I'm yeah. going to start digging. All right. Um, uh, but before we get on to Steph, the Love reason you. that you're here is because of nominations. So it was only the pure housemates that got to nominate this week. Um, who do you think nominated you? There was only um, four. Daniela. Um, I think Gemma nominated me. I think, who else have we got there? It's pretty tough then. Um, there was I, I, Scotty I, well, and John Carty, I know nominate. Scott didn't nominate me. Um, and I don't know, I think the other four, obviously. And maybe Tiffany, I don't know. It was a bit of a shock, like, but... Tiffany didn't nominate because she was... Uh, oh, she was a was toxic housemate, yeah, so yeah. I'm not sure. Look, really. you're forgetting, you've only just Yeah, I know, out, like, it's a blur. Would like, you like to take a look at who yeah, did? Please, Here we yeah. go. My first nomination is Jeremy. 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 His relationship with Stephanie provides the house with much drama, much tension. The situation is a bit uncontrollable for everybody. I think it's getting everybody down. He's not taking anyone's advice and it can be disruptive to the house. So, you said you just hoped Scotty didn't and he didn't. I so know, you must yeah. be quite relieved about that. Yeah, but what do you think about their reasons? Um, I don't totally understand their reasons. I had everyone pull me up on what was happening. But like I said, you know what I mean? You, you go with what you feel at the time. Mm. and. You know, I could have easily sat back and, I don't know, I was just gravitated towards her. I kept... You certainly did. I don't know what it looks like. I'm sorry if... Well, like... in a minute, you'll see exactly what it looked like. Um, uh, do you think, though, had it been normal nominations and the whole house no, had I think nominated, I still do you been think up. you'd still... Yeah, 100%. You'd like, still you know have I, mean? I, was, I was always going to be in it for... But that's, that's me, do you know what I mean? You like me or you hate me, and it's, mm. it's the way I live my life. I just... I, I act on what I feel, and, you know, some people don't like that. I'm a bit lazy, maybe, as well, so I don't know. Like... Um... Well, most of your nominations was because of your relationship with yeah, Stephanie. I know, so yeah. let's take a look at the two of you together. I love Jeremy to bits. I'd be lying if I said I didn't like her. It was a bit not like you like. No, we're just having a laugh. It is more than friends. It's obvious. Thanks for ruining my relationship, big brother. What you're doing is so wrong. You've got a boyfriend. It's like you want your cake and you want to eat it. Maybe I've Substituted Jez for Sam. No, You'll be with him, so yeah, yeah Marion. I'm gonna. She will go back to her boyfriend and she will be dropped like a sack of. Who still not know why she cannot just say to me how she really feels? Oh my god! Yes, okay. I'm nothing to you anyway. You're allowed to play me like a fool when you have a boyfriend. I'm not allowed to have a game with the lads, is it? Okay. Please. I swear <laughs> down, I love that girl. Steph, you'll never work again off the back of this show. I just want to go home. I think she's had enough and I'll walk out with her, like, do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> that looks, yeah, it's obviously... What, were you, you were just about to say, that looks... I thought that was, like, uh, one of Hugh Hefner's videos or something. <laughs> was, uh... No, it, it, look, it is what it is. I can't really elaborate on that. It's, that's, what, that's what happens. That's, that's what we felt for each other and, you know, it's, it's um, obviously... I like to think that I'm a respectful lad, but you know, I understand what our fella must be going through on that. But so, know, just... so what? What is your side of the story? Because obviously, <coughs> we we, we kind of know all the story, but but what was happening within you, and how did you feel? Because we did hear you say 
from the beginning, that's not what I do. I don't go for girls who have boyfriends. I don't the, get involved yeah. with things like that. I wouldn't yeah. break up a relationship. No. But you just, you, and you said, I want to pull away. I'm not going to get involved in this. But you kept going back. Yeah. No, I tried it, but I just I kept going back to her. Yeah, I don't know if it's, the, like I said, if I was on the outside, I'd be able to go somewhere, do you know what I mean? But when there's someone that you, you sit there with and mm. you have feelings for, do you know what I mean? There's nothing that you can do about it. And yeah. it just kept getting stronger, like a snowball effect. But um, uh, what about when you were getting all the advice from everybody? Mm. Like, Scotty T, your best mate in there. I mean, you could kind of... This is me watching, and I hope other people will agree, because, you know, uh, I'm a viewer as well. Um, <laughs> but he seemed to get quite frustrated <sighs> on your behalf, on behalf of the situation, that everybody was telling you, yeah. it's not that long. There are other people in here in relationships know, that yeah. are, are containing themselves. Why not know, just like... wait, because she has a boyfriend, and deal with it after the show? Yeah. Well, like, that's what I was doing at the, at the time, but then I think she said that there was other things going on. I know it was the right thing to do, it was just wait, but mm. look, I can't explain what, I'm, what I feel inside, or I, can't act, or I can't act differently than what I've done, you know? It's, it's too late now, but that's what I felt, and I went with it, you know? Mm. Um, that's just... That's Do, me, like. you know I mentioned the crowd reaction and you got quite a positive one yeah. in, compar in comparison yeah, yeah. to what Stephanie's getting. And I personally think that if it had been the other way around and it had been a single woman going for an attached man, she would have got as much stick as he would have. 100%. You've gotten off very lightly, really, when you think well, about it. Well, I hold it. my hand up, and I always said like that was, it was both of us. Do you mm. know what I mean? I'm not, I'm not trying to skive away. Like, it's, it's just a really tough situation. I know, it's, it's terrible, but... How do you think you would feel if you were in Sam's position? Gutted. Absolutely gutted. He isn't here tonight. We haven't been able to make contact with him. I would imagine you're quite relieved. No, I... Like I said, like, I was like, go out and whatever. It's like after, you know, after this whole thing, go and chat to him and go and do your own thing. Take a breathing space, like, take your time. And mm. I don't know what's going to happen. Look, this is... It's just the way it was, and... Yeah. If I'm portrayed... Did like, you ever think... Because she, she got a lot of grief in the house mm. because of it. Again, more than you did, and she was yeah. hearing a lot of booze more than you did. Did you ever think, kind of for her sake, and to, to protect her, maybe the best thing I should do is back off? I know you, you say you can't help your feelings, and it's human nature. People mm. fall in love with people when they're not expecting to, and that happens. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Um, I, tried to, I tried to pull away a few times. I think we both did, but like we said, we just said, look, just let's go with it, because we just keep finding each other. I know it's obviously in a, yeah. what was it, like, 200 square foot garden and that, like, of course you're going to keep finding it. <laughs> That's stupid, but um, I can't, I just, what happened happened, and I can't really elaborate, you know, everything that I said to her I meant. Mm. I do understand the boyfriend situation. If it was done to me, if it was done to any other lad, I normally am, I hold myself, like, I like, think I have a bit of integrity, but obviously I don't. Uh, we saw you give her a necklace before you left the house. Yeah, no, just good luck, like, it was my mum and brother's picture, like, just to... Uh, yeah, there it is, there, like, um, just to... So, what do you think is going to happen? <laughs> You're not getting that back. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think is going to happen between the two of you? I don't know, like I said, like, everyone's like, it's a bubble, it's a, it's a different environment out here, which of course it is, you know. I always thought logical about the situation, and we'll see what happens, you know. She mm. needs breathing space, I need my time as well. And then, um, if it's meant to be, I suppose, like... Because it did look like it's gone from, let's just, we're mates, we're mates. Uh, to a bit more than mates, and then yeah. she's still got yeah. a boyfriend. Then she kind of had her epiphany when Gillian was there and said, I want to be single. Mm. And then that night, she was back in bed with you, and then all of a sudden, it was like, suddenly you were just acting like a normal couple in the house. Yeah, it was weird So it's that been night. very flip-floppy for her and her emotions. Are you worried that now that you're away, she might have time to think, and then she might come out and go, I've balls this up now, I want to be She could Sam. possibly do, you know? Like Does if, that worry you? No, not at all, because, like... Being apart, you know, like, it, it gives it, both of us a time to think. And I'm not, say, I'm not saying that, you know, when she comes out, we're going we're gonna to start being together and like that we don't need time off. Like, and I'm saying to her, I was like, even if you do, don't think it's right with Sam, you still need time to be single and reflect on what you want. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So. But you've already asked her to go on holiday. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. We saw that too, didn't we? Didn't oh, we? that's it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but, you know, like, because she, she's very low on self-esteem. She hasn't been, like, so she's told me, you know, she hasn't been, like, shown a good side of life. And... No, I'd like to think that I'm a... I can't really say good lad now, but, you know, I, I treat a woman with respect, like... And I want um, to... Do you have any regrets? No, like, it was kind of... I remember the yes-no game and the... It was a task, like... And I was like, do I... Re you do regret getting with 
probably developing feelings like that with someone that has a boyfriend, but now I don't, like, and we'll see what happens after, like, but it was just, it's a, it's a really hard situation, and I looked at, I watched Big Brother since I was a kid, man, do you know what I mean? It's, it's a lot who, harder than... Who would you like to see win? Obviously, Steph or Scott, you like, I think Steph needs it. Do you think she will? It. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Here are your best bits, yeah, thank nice. you. Everybody says we look alike. Oh, really? Lovely accent. Thanks. Lovely tattoos. I think the women are going to love him. You look gorgeous. Thanks. I'm very what sexually attracted to him. <laughs> Do you fancy me? Of course. Being Jeremy, he's like me big brother. Do you feel like it's more than just friends? You know, it is more than friends. It was weird, though, aren't you like? No, we're just having a laugh. I mean, you're cuddling every, every f ten minutes. Yeah. It's like you want your cake and you want to eat it. I'm looking to you anyway. You're allowed to play me like a feel when you have a boyfriend. What you're doing is wrong. Yeah. Jess! What? I want to say goodbye to you before I go. It's, it's too much, man. It's going around and my head is uh, melted. Jeremy. Whoa. Yeah. I love just a bit, so he's got a cuddle for me, he's cheeky. You're a awesome geezer, mate. He is like my brother, and I love the kid a bit. Jeremy is crazy sexy cool. How's your baseball bat today? It's actually for free, isn't it? My time in the Big Brother house has been amazing. I've met so many different walks of life, you know, so many characters with different stories. And all in all, it's been, it's been brilliant. Thanks so much. Listen, best of luck with yeah, the future yeah. and everything that happens. Yeah, thanks so Go to your friends and family. <sighs>